You okay? Yeah. Is that you? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, stop asking me. You seem distant, I don't know. Right, well, I'm not distant, I'm here. Right here. Present. Relax. Okay. Sorry. It's just, you said... You said a while ago that you felt sad, and I thought it was more seasonal affective disorder sad, but it isn't, is it? It's sad sad. I don't know, Rose. I'm just worried. Can we not do this, please? We haven't touched feet in bed in a while. What? You move away every time I try and touch feet with you. I don't mean to. You can be distant too. No, I'm not. You never want to have sex. That's not true. You're always too tired. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, when I'm... When was the last time? Literally like a week ago. Well, right, I don't think that was with me then. Okay, fine, maybe two. Months. Yes. Two months. Leave me alone, James. See? Is it nice being pestered? Is it? And attacked. Attacked? Okay, not attacked. Interrogated. I wasn't interrogating you. The difference is you interrogate me, whereas I calmly try to communicate with you. Well, that's not true. That's what has just happened. I'm, I'm afraid I, I don't respond to interrogation. It doesn't work on me. So know this by now. I was calmly trying to communicate with you. I asked you, completely fairly, why you seem blow, and you chose to get defensive. I'm not being defensive. Yes, you are. I want to know why we aren't having sex. Leave me alone, James. Rose, you can't just tell me to leave you alone whenever I attempt to communicate an issue with you after you've just complained that I'm incapable of communicating with you. Well, you tell me what's going on in your head then and I'll tell you why I'm too tired to fuck. You know what? It's kind of counterintuitive to the whole communication thing to make it a tit-for-tat thing. Like, surely we should just have a normal conversation. So I just we... tried to have a normal conversation with you and you shut it down. No, you made it some weird communication, tit-for-tat. I'll tell you if you tell me competition. Clearly, we both have some issues we need to address. Issues? You know, like, obstacles, hurdles. Right. Well, you tell me what obstacles, hurdles and issues you feel we are facing then. Well. Yes. We're not fucking rose. Come on, you know this. Why aren't we fucking these two fuck like sort of, you know, rodents? Rodents? You? They fuck a lot, don't they? Isn't that what they say? You know, like, fuck like rodents. Or... Bunnies, you idiot. Right, bunnies, rodents, same thing, same thing. No, James. Rodents are dirty, disgusting creatures. I don't fuck you like a rodent. Oh, no, of course not. You're never dirty and disgusting. James, we don't fuck like rodents, okay? We make love. Sometimes it's disgusting, but not like rodents. Okay, okay, sorry. Rephrase, love making. Oh, James, I'm tired. I know, Rose, you've said already. You've had a long day. I'm not tired of today, I'm tired of everything. What do you mean? Do you mean... You don't mean me, do you? Are you tired of me? Rose, I'm sorry. work. I'm tired of work and I'm tired of not being able to move to London and live near my family and it's isolating, okay? I feel isolated. I hate it here. This wasn't meant to be the plan. We were meant to have a house in London by now and we can't afford it and we'll never be able to afford it. And do you know what else I'm tired of? I'm tired of being underpaid and overworked and I'm tired of having to tell Doreen and Janet and Robert and Pat that they can only have Jaffa cakes on a Friday when they don't even know what day of the week it is. It's confusing for them and it makes them sad and they don't have long left, so why should they be sad? And I'm tired of the way Mark runs the home. He's a miserable git and I'm tired of the way he talks to me. I'm tired of working relentlessly and not being paid overtime only to come home and not being able to turn the heating on and constantly, constantly having a runny nose and I've gained weight. 
and I don't have the energy nor the stamina nor the body confidence to engage in being touched and feeling desirable and having sex right now. Okay. Rose, you're perfect. Beautiful. I love your body. I know. It doesn't stop me from feeling undesirable though. I hate that. I'm sorry. 